All right, we have my son's Yamaha TTR90. What's the problem? It has no stickers. It has no stickers on it. Should we fix that? Yeah. All right, we got a sticker kit right here. I put stickers on the dry way and the wet way. I kind of like the wet way better because it kind of is easier to do and it, the results turn out to be better. It does take a little longer, but that's fine. So what we need here, we have some alcohol. The spray bottle right there is filled with water, alcohol, and dish soap. And then a heat gun, and we have like a little squeegee thing we use to, to flatten out the stickers. So, should we get to work? Yeah. All right. All right, I'm gonna start with this back section part of the sticker. So the first thing I like to do is just clean the area. I'm just using some of that alcohol to kind of just clean down this whole area. So yeah, that one should fit right there nicely. So the next part, get your solution of water, dish soap, and that alcohol. Spray it down. And then just unpeel the sticker. And spray it on this side. And then just place it on there. You can move it around and I like to do it this way because you can you can put it down and then move it around if it's not right and it doesn't stick so well. So you can get it right in place where you want it. Just take your time. So then when you kind of get your sticker where you want it, you know, that looks fine here. So that's when you use your, your heat gun and then your little squeegee tool. But I just start in the middle and then start working your way out and around and then supply the heat. Don't, don't use too much heat because you'll melt the sticker. So I usually do it in the lowest setting and then heat it up and, and work your way around here until you get it the way you like it and all the bubbles are out. So yeah, just work your way around the uh, whole area. Um, get all the, you, you can push push the, all the water out and all the, any air bubbles out and yeah, it looks like that turned out good. Um, and here we got some discolored plastic, so this back one is probably not going to cover up all that discolored plastic. So a lot of the time you can just use your heat gun and then warm up the area. A lot of times it'll turn back to the original blue color. We have a Honda, a red color. So you can kind of play around with that just to see if that'll work out for you. up the bike I made him go blindfolded all right ready take it off oh my god this is awesome dude oh, this is awesome. <laughs> so yeah here's this what it so looks awesome. like there's really no bubbles or anything 
looks so bad last on time. It. Now look at it now, it's awesome. Yeah, it looks pretty cool with the stickers on. It really makes the bike look a lot different. Okay, yeah, sit on there, see how you look. All right, yeah. It's gonna look cool. Yeah, it only took me maybe like 45 minutes to do the whole bike. So, yeah, it's uh, doing the wet method was pretty simple. It's nice to be able to move the stickers around pretty easily. So that's that's what I like about it. But all right, should we uh, take this baby outside and take her for a ride? Yeah. All right. 